Holy heck, Bob was suited and booted. Hi guys, and welcome back to the next episode of Harmony Hollow, and today we are on the server because we have things we need to do. So, first thing I want to address, for some reason, I can't get shaders to work. I don't quite know why, but it has decided to have a break. But I mean, it shouldn't be too bad because we're quite often in wolf form or werewolf form, so it would break in shaders anyway, so we might just need to deal without it for a while. But we first need to head to spawn because there are a few things I need to buy. One being flu powder, the other being tape for my wings. I'm gonna take everything I have, basically, because I need as much as I can get, and I have quite a lot of diamonds from all my strip mining, so we should be good. I unfortunately wasn't smart with my flu powder and did not think to save a piece to go back to spawn and I don't have spawn marked so we're gonna have to make a run to Jack's house or Calm's house and then it's north from there so that's probably the best way to do this but obviously we're not going to do it in normal form we're going to change into a beast form so we're a giant swole beast who can then sprint so fast what even is this? I'm surprised the hunters are actually wanting to try and fight me because I mean even if I was a werewolf hunter and seen this thing I'd be like lol no. The only thing with the beast form is it shreds through hunger. Does a wolf form go through it as much? We'll see because I know wolf form is equally as fast. Actually to be honest I think I'm faster. I don't jump as high but I think I'm faster. Okay so if Jack's house is that way I think spawn is this way. Can I get in a boat as a wolf? That's the real question here. Oh my goodness, I can. I'm dead. <laughs> this looks so stupid. My legs are just sticking out the bottom of it. Air spawn. We'll grab our boat back and then we're good to continue on. Right, this is Nova's wing shop. Creative wings. Brett is selling for a dragon egg. I'm sorry, what? I mean, I know I could maybe get one from a lucky block, so I could try just making some lucky blocks. I was expecting it to maybe be like a stack and a bit of diamonds, not a dragon egg. Right, we're gonna pop down here and then we're gonna go to a flu, which is over here. So it's five diamonds for 32. I'm gonna get a stack. A stack and a bit. That makes no sense. Well, I'm very confused as to how I now have a stack and a bit. And I have no idea what this is. Oh, this is to do with the sorting hat thing. That I've still not done. We're also going to check if we've had... Oh, we have had some more donations. Let's see. They're all ones I know, which makes me feel like most of them will probably already be here. Freeze and Snowball are in there, which is ice ones. I'm now realizing that someone has not put the books back in the order that they came from. Someone has come into my library and messed up the system. Why? Why would someone do that? Okay, the library is now sorted. I've put away all the books into the correct places. I also need to find out who it was that's put them in the wrong places so I can murder them. Now we need to go to the sorting ceremony, sorting hat thing. I'm not sure what it's called. We'll just try everything. This was not what I typed in. Okay, so I did a little YouTube, couldn't find it, but I know if I go to Delfron and then it's over this way from their house, I'm going to sleep at their house though. Because although I can be a big bad werewolf, I still don't want to, you know, die. Oh, there's a little wizard tower. I mean, with it being this close to their house, I'm assuming they've been in it. Oh, that's a good wizard. What have you got? Spell book, you'll give me five of those. Telekinesis, sorcerer leggings, summon zombie. I mean, I have most of them, so I'm just gonna break the window and run it. Ow! Oh, he didn't like the fact that I broke his window. I got an achievement over the fact that he didn't like that I broke his window. Make a wizard angry. That's awkward. I just wanted to climb out. Okay, so this is the wizard sorting area. So welcome to the sorting ceremony. All are welcome, the house cup beckons you all. To join, simply check out all of the tents. Once you decide on a house, grab a paper and put your name in the house. Place your paper into the chest of the house you want. Good luck. Okay, so I need to see what the traits are. Full of charisma, sought after for your skill set, cheerful and kind, strong heart, rich in friendship, a great support to those around them. Okay, green, honest, straightforward and to the point, loyal to a fault, 
quick on their feet, strive for success, decisive. Then we have adaptive to the world around them, passionate, fierce competitor, flexible and easy to work with, trailblazers and trustworthy. And then blue, tough to crack under pressure, shine bright amongst their peers, self-sufficient, beacon of persistent, admired by all for their personality, started off rough but polished to perfection. I don't like this one. Like the blue house makes you seem full of yourself. Hmm, I don't know what one to pick. Like in Harry Potter houses, I'm definitely Ravenclaw, but the descriptions of the diamond house makes you seem like a So I don't know. I feel like this was written with prejudice against Ravenclaws and I'm suing. We're taking a bit of paper. We're gonna pop it in here. You know what, I think I'm gonna go for the gold house. So I meant to pop it in here and then I meant to take a care package, which is just a bunch of yellow things. We love care packages. Let's go home. And then I'm assuming we're meant to decorate with these things. I mean, it's not going to fit my color scheme at all. You know what, we're just gonna shove it all up here because no one comes up here. Oh, it'll look like cute yellow cur- I was gonna say it look like yellow curtains. It will look like yellow curtain. I'll just pop it there and everything else can just go in here. Right, now we need to repair our wings. We need to pop in our diamonds, pop the emeralds back. And I want to see how much gold we have. Okay, we have a bunch of gold. Let's make ourselves some lucky blocks and hope we get a dragon egg. I feel like that's probably the best way to do this because I would like to get one of the creative wings. It's ridiculous that the thing you need for them is a dragon egg. Okay, I've got my lucky blocks. We'll go way over here and we'll open them just in case they're really bad. I should probably also be in like a wolf form of some sorts. I'm a bit stronger in a wolf form. Okay, we got a couple ender chests, not bad. A bunch of gold armor, which I think I can break down and turn back into gold. Holy no. Oh God. I tried to punch him and he wouldn't blow up. Why? Oh God. Oh yay! It was another nice one! That's how I got a bunch of diamonds and emeralds last time. Oh more! I mean there's a bunch of chickens that I want, but I got more diamonds, so I'll take that. Ah! No again! Okay. Oh! I got some spawn eggs. Villager, squid, a lurker, and a cow. I don't know what a lurker is. Oh, it's a bounce house! Okay. I'm into it. I can leave that there until I eventually need slime for something. And it was a bow and a bunch of arrows, which I didn't really want. Right, we'll put away the spawn eggs and such. And then we'll try and see if I can deconstruct the armor and see if I can make it back into more gold for more lucky blocks. Because you can make it a uncrafting table, I think it's called. Which is just a crafting table surrounded by cobblestone. We can then just pop that there and then all i do is pop this in okay oh this is great like yeah it uses a lot of of experience each time but for the extra gold cost oh i'll even break the wings down into everything that's cool will it give me enchantment books no it doesn't give me enchantment books back what about a wand just a stick okay interesting okay i've got more droppers i need to make more of those okay we're gonna run back to our lucky block station Oh, some diamond gear. I can break that down for more diamonds. A lucky ball. I like them. More rainbow sheep, which I mean is just great for my rainbow island. Music desk and jukebox. Bob. Bob, stay away. I killed Bob! And I got ridiculously good armor. Holy heck. Bob was suited and booted. Right. So that happened. There's just a witch there. I don't know how I was meant to avoid that, honestly. Okay, we have one more. Experience potions to get me back all the levels I just lost. Thank you. I mean, it's not the dragon egg that I wanted, but it's something. Well, I mean, at least we now have, the wings will let us fly forever. And we now know we can go back and buy more. I like being able to buy things. It means I don't need to do the work for them. Also, I read the comments and a bunch of you were not a fan of the rugs. So I'm gonna go out and shear the cyan sheep and the blue sheep. And we'll make a new rug because you're all hating it for some reason. I thought it was very cute. Okay, we're gonna make some light blue carpet. We'll make some dark blue carpet and we'll just replace some things around. There, is everyone happier with this rug? Wait, this bit should be white. 
I didn't mean to make a pattern, but it's what's happened. There we go. That rug's cute. I don't have enough to change that rug, so that rug is going to stay ugly. But this one will stay cute. So we have been to spawn. We have restocked on flu powder, got ourselves some new wings. We have sorted ourselves into the gold house. We also now know that we need a dragon egg because that makes sense to get the creative wings, which basically just means they don't need duct tape, so it's definitely worth doing. I may need to maybe see about going to the end. I think that might be an option. Maybe see about doing it with like a couple people. I really just want the creative wings, that's all I want. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Harmony Hall. If you did, remember to leave a like. Comment down below what you want to see me do next episode. Should I build something? Should I go adventuring? Let me know in the comment section down below. Remember to subscribe if you're new to the channel, hit the notification bell so you do not miss a video, and I will see See you all next time. Bye!